All right, guys, a little backstory as I open this hive up. Lady contacts me and says, from the emergency room, and said, this hive went ballistic on her, and she wanted it gone because she's now in anaphylaxis. So I've worked this whole yard. I picked it up the other night, brought it up here. Now we're gonna to get to see what's going on in this box. Make sure the smoke is going good. Let's pop the top and see what's going on. She does want the honey back. Okay, so no immediate bailout only. A couple of hive beetles. Has an inner cover with the entrance to the back, which I do not use and would not recommend because especially during winter, the air is coming in the front, straight up through everything and right out the back. All right. Yeah, they are a little aggressive, but good God, it's a hive beetle. There's probably 30 right here, just on that inner cover. That in itself can make a hive aggressive. Especially if they're overrun down in the brood chamber and everything with them, that would definitely make them aggressive. But, ah, knocked it over. Let's go back and see if we can get back to going what's up here. So, immediately we found five beetles. Top super looks empty. When we moved it, it did not feel that heavy. More high beetles. I also need to add, this is a hive from Georgia. This is a package that she bought from Georgia, South Georgia. And we all know what can come out of South, Deep South, according to the Tennessee State Apiarist, it only takes 13% of Africanized genetics to get them to ball out of a hive on you. So I would definitely say these are definitely not Africanized. Maybe a little, but not what you would consider. I mean, can't see out of my veil type Africanized. All right, so I'm just gonna take this next box off. <sighs> Sweat to death, it's already 90 degrees and 100 and I think 50% humidity it feels like. All right, next one down. Looks like it's got some honey in it. Get too old to work 10 frames. All right, next one down. Single medium above the brood chamber. And I just got stung through the glove. This right here is unacceptable behavior in my breeding program. So if this girl makes it through to spring, she will be reclaimed. Let's see, where's my in my pocket, my marking stuff, because I'm going to mark this girl if I can find her. Because I found that out the hard way a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. Had a queen that filled up four deep 10 frame boxes with brood. I had to do a four way split 
thank goodness she was actually in one of the ones I moved off the original location. Can you imagine trying to find that queen? In a 10 frame deep box with, oh yeah. That's a reaction right there. Yeah, buddy. She's dying if I find her right now. I am not going to wait till spring. She is dying and I will be reclaiming it. Ladies and gentlemen, there she is. There she was. Now all I'm doing is checking for health of the brood. So we got lucky in the beginning and found her right off. So I'm going to chop this up to crappy genetics out of South Georgia. You guys can say what you want. You can bash it in the comments, whatever. Proof is in the pudding right here. I could open this hive right here before now, go through it in a veil, t-shirt, pants, shorts, not have a problem. I'm not going to open another hive because that's the only one I got left. But I'm not about to open another hive because of this behavior. If I didn't have gloves on, my hands would be stung. I've already been stung a couple times in the glove. I'm glad they haven't found the area between my wrist and my glove. Now, the fun part is going to be getting all the bees out of here. Yeah, that's going to be a lot of fun. I mean, look at them. They're 20, 30 yards out flying around. So, yeah, this is going to be fun. I think I'm going to go ahead and stop the video here because all I'm going to do is set this one over where the camera's at, put that one that's empty on there, take the frames out, shake the bees into it, give it a funnel to go down into the, the box. I'm going to take the honey back to the lady because she said she did want out. That got me through the glove too. Uh, she did want the honey. Thanks for watching. Share the aggressiveness.